Okay. So it is the following morning. I've just had some breakfast and uh, I did all the selling I could do here and uh, traded pretty much everything save for the PDA, which I would like to take a look at. I had it decoded um, and yeah, like I thought there was a, uh, a stash. When the, brain got a, when the brain grinder started to come down, he made a stash in a rusty electrical box at the factory. This should be at uh, Yantar, probably. I, mean, I doubt he managed to. Uh, a lonely bandit. I doubt he managed to stash anything else. Well, I'm going to take the batteries out of the PDA that we found, and also, I got my hands on a handgun repair kit, bought one from here, uh, in exchange for everything else, and uh, that is not how you use a handgun repair kit, uh, you need to use it with the basic tools, right, here we go, and then, uh, I can fix the CZ-75, or I could fix, <coughs> sorry, or I could fix the Lebedev PL-15, which, well, I mean, we're gonna fix the Lebedev, right? It's, I'm pretty sure I only have the parts to fix the Lebedev anyway, and I think I need a different, um, a different, whoops, okay, a, a different barrel for the, um, for the CZ, but regardless, here we go. 11,000 rubles, that cost me. 11 thousand. Truly a um, awe-inspiring amount. I think to fix the Lebedev, um, or have the mechanic fix it with his own tools and stuff, was like 17 or 18 thousand rubles. That wasn't a lot. That really wasn't a lot, and now I'm left with one use for the handgun repair thing, so yeah, I mean, I saved money. Definitely saved money, but I haven't saved that much, honestly. Uh, let's put some jacketed hollow point in, which we have right now. I thought we had some FMJ. We don't. Uh, okay, and then there's also one thing, one more thing I want to do. And let's use the gunsmithing tools to get some ammo. Now, I think I can fix, yeah, the 9 times 19 um, jacketed hollow point ones. So let's do that. Getting a bit extra, and then I'll do the rest later, because I'm pretty sure I have the ammo for everything else I need for now. How much do I have for this? Yeah, it's like 115. Yeah, you know, it could be worse. Oh, I actually don't have all the ammunition for... Uh, for 545 five by 39 that's... okay. <clears throat> Interesting. 545 five by 39 I always confuse this ammo with 556. Five, it is the, the equivalent, but um, I understand the, the, the difference. It's not that, you know, they look similar. I, I, I confuse them when, when looking at them. It's that I confuse them. They run verbally. If that makes sense. Like, I'll talk about 556, five, or I'll talk about 545 five times 39, and I'll say the other thing for some reason. <laughs> it's a brain fart, but, you know. Um... Same with the ammunition for the Tokarev. Like, 30 caliber. It's 7.62. Second one, that's the same ammunition that the, um... That the Kalashnikov uses, except it's a longer bullet, I mean, but it's it's the same, like, you know, it's the same number. <laughs> yes. It's, uh, look, you, you got to hand it to the Soviet Design Bureau. I, are you gonna are you gonna shoot me because I'm boring you with talk of ammunition? Um, you got to hand it to the Soviet Design Bureau. They have perfected one caliber of ammunition, and they stick with it. You want assault rifle ammunition? 30 caliber. You want pistol ammunition? 30 caliber. You want submachine gun ammunition? 30 caliber. You want machine gun ammunition? 
well, okay, it's not just 30 caliber, but, you know, a lot of them are 30 caliber. Uh, that is until they've modernized the AKs and the uh, you know, 74 has a smaller cartridge, but anyways. Um, I feel like there's, there's not much else to talk about, right? We might as well talk about cartridges. Um, I feel like it's overrated. Um, what, 30 caliber? No, no, no. <laughs> Definitely not. Uh, I feel like the difference between 7.62 and uh, 5.45 or 5.56 is grossly overrated by a lot of people. Uh, they, they, I think a lot of people, especially if they haven't actually had experience with the weapons and just talk about them based on paper. I need a drink. Hey, you want to stop at the, at the church? Yeah, okay, we'll, we'll, we'll stop at the church. <laughs> Don't shoot me, but there, you can drink that. <laughs> Well, not actually, come on, jeez. <laughs> if you don't have any, any water, I'll share some with you, but... You know, like... <laughs> uh, we have slept through the entire night. I wonder if there's more bandits at the church now. Yes, there are, and I just flinched. <laughs> I just flinched. Okay. Okay. Anybody else want to go? Mate, could you come over, please? Hands up. Hands up. What are you doing? Come on, it's stop. Okay. Who or what is this? And do we shoot him? I'm half tempted to shoot him, I really, really am, but he's not an active threat, so we might as well leave him alone. Shot the other two guys, these were renegades. One more fabrics there. Ah, I forgot I don't have a Geiger counter on me, that is annoying. loot your friends now, okay. Well, I'm... I say your friends, you were... And you look like you were sharing a drink here, I... Don't want to assume anything, but at the same time... I understand bandits and renegades have a... have a good relationship with each other, and they understand each other and don't... fight, but, uh... Renegades sure shoot the crap out of us mercs most of the time, so yeah, I saw him. And he was aiming at me, so he knows I'm here. Uh, there's a guy outside, and it's probably a renegade. You want to go and check it out? Should we go upstairs and try and shoot him? I think that's that's our best bet, honestly. I've hit him. Oh, 
пацаны, выручайте! Oh, I'm sorry, I... Sake. You don't stand up in the middle of a fucking gunfight, you moron. You absolute bloody moron. He says proceeding to loot the snot out of him. Why would you? you oh, I'm so mad at you. I am. I understand you're dead, but I am bloody pissed off at you. Why on earth would you stand up in the middle of a gunfight? Would you try and broker a peace agreement between the renegades and the mercs here and now? Really? This is the one I wanted to check. I know there was a stash in there. Never mind. I... Okay, what's my reputation now? Uh, companions, bandits, goodwill 75. I mean, it's not terrible. Um, statistics. Reputation bad. Yeah, look lovely. Just, just, just lovely. Okay, I think we should go and recover the tracking device, and then, uh, and then be on our way, basically. So this way. You absolute bloody moron! What were you? Th Thinking. Well, I'll just stand up, and you know he's friendly. He won't shoot me. Just yes, but oh, never mind. Um, I'm gonna use these tablets because I'm pretty sure I have some radiation poisoning, and would like to get rid of it. And I'm also gonna put a. Med kit to good use. Well, relatively good use. I haven't lost that much health, but every tiny bit helps. Now that we've dealt with that unpleasant little situation, let's see. Um, let's see about recovering that tracking device. First of all, I'm pretty sure it's left on a corpse over here. Uh, I'm not going over there. There is nothing that's going to make me go over there until I have, like, some top-tier armor, because I know what's there. A uh, little bird told me. And, um... Yeah, Clear Sky are kind of arseholes for sending people over there without any, you know, information as to, uh... what is over there. But they've sent a merc before... Like I mentioned, one of my friends, and I uh, haven't heard from him since. I have heard from him while he was there, and yeah. Okay. We good? One would assume so, yes. I, I, what I don't understand is when... Okay, my rank has improved. Um, so I'm terrible as a person, but at least I'm good at being terrible as a person, I suppose. And that, that's what I'm going to take out of all of this. Um, okay. What I don't understand, however, is when exactly did the zone get teleported to England, or is it just the swamp that's in England, which would be kind of fitting. 
in that it is constantly raining. Crying out loud, stop. Okay. Um, do you see anything? No. No, no I didn't think so. Um, here's what I'm wondering can I get you a rifle of some description? Because I'm pretty sure you've picked a few up. But I don't see you using them, is it? Do you need ammo or something? I'm willing to share. I have a good bit of money. Saved up. If you want, like an, I don't know, like an AK or something, I can get you one. If you can fix it yourself and, and get it to pristine condition, that'd be lovely. But if you can't, I'm willing to lend a hand. Mission update search and rescue. Mission update search and rescue. What? Did you pick a fight with someone? Pretty sure that's you. Okay, you've got a Mosin now, that's not entirely what I meant by modernizing your your uh Hellfire, Hellfire. Not entirely what I meant by modernizing your arsenal, but uh, what are we It's those tiny little rat-like creatures. Получи, гад. Okay, I didn't shoot you, did it? No, no, no. no. Face. I thought you were behind me. I really didn't see you move up. Sorry, I think I nearly hit you. Um... Yeah, I really don't know what you what you what you're trying to hit, mate. Also, you've somehow turned that Mosin into a semi-automatic instead of a bolt-action rifle, which. I don't know if I should be terrified or impressed by. Probably a bit of both. I'm assuming this is your doing, but we don't need to be picking a fight with whomever is over there. Oh, what the hell, let's go. Now, this... Th this is your problem, not mine. I I'm not about to... I thought these were bandits. Genuinely thought these were bandits, and I think they genuinely thought I was one of them. <laughs> 
and didn't want to get involved because I was like, no, no. Stop shooting at the people not hostile to me, but I think we... came to an understanding together before we actually set off on who we're hostile with and who we're not and that we should uh, act accordingly and that we don't have any trouble um, if we determine who our common enemies are and stuff but yeah it's, <laughs> it's a bit more complicated on the field I guess that is okay I, I shouldn't be laughing in the face of danger like that but at the end of the day, it's bandits, like... Or it's renegades. It's just... Difference isn't that big, but it's a big one to me. For example, this is, I think, a bandit. Hello? Yes. Uh, is there any work you need done? You need a Beretta 92F alternative version of it. No. Um, I mean, I'd love to, but I don't have one. Um... But I'm trying to point something out, like, see, Bandit, we're perfectly fine with him. Renegades, very different group. Um, very different group, we're not, we're not big fans of those. Uh, yeah, 919 barrel, recoil assembly, and single action trigger. The CZ75, I, uh, I'll fix it when I get to it, I think, like... No, there's no reason to focus on it right now. I'll, I'll do it eventually. But we've we've been sidetracked again. But honestly, not that much. We kind of we were sidetracked, but we ended up where we needed to be, more or less. And now we're heading up north. So let's do that. Um, Nocturnal, mate, I'm gonna need your help here with the mutants. I wish the AK came with some kind of, uh, <clears throat> some kind of hunting round or something. That would, uh, make my job a hell of a lot easier currently. Than it is, but, uh, it doesn't, so, what I can do about that, I suppose. Okay, no Nocturnal, mate. Yeah, I really need you to... Really need you to get over here. Okay. Overkill? Yes. Was it necessary? I mean, it's sort of in the word. No. But it's a completely black dog. I haven't seen one of these, I don't think, ever. Uh, there's nothing useful yet. No wonder. Okay, where are we? Uh, that way should be the tracking device. I mean, that's just... Just perfect, honestly. I'm trying to jump above the reeds and stuff so I can see. I'm just calling it, if it's attached to some kind of lurker, Hymera, or cat, we're running. Okay, we're not gonna run from the cat, that's a little bit embarrassing. It's a little bit embarrassing. I already have a bad reputation. I need to add... reputation of a coward to it, so... We're not going to run from a cat, but anything else, we are running. It is straight ahead. Okay. My friends picked a fight with someone. Tell you what, you fight over there. And I'll fight over here against something. No, it is still dead ahead. I just 
ran over it. There it is. Whoa, 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 okay. Yeah, I have no idea what that is. Uh, well, I have an idea what that is. That's the thing that my mate picked a fight with, but I have no idea who or what just shot me. Uh, so I'm going to go and rescue him again, eh? Oh, for fuck's sake. Okay, maybe based on his location I can discern that yeah, there's this something in there. I saw him! I saw him! Now I have a... Uh, I wouldn't say a disadvantage, uh, an advantage. I would say a slightly more even playing field. Now, I understand there's more. That's fine. Uh, I'll switch to EP. That guy was wearing some what looked like heavy armor, I don't know. Yeah, it is a renegade, and it is an exoscute. Exoscute? Exosuit. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. That is, uh... Oh, no, no, no. It's, it's bugged when you're dead. Isn't it? No, no, it's not. Okay. I mean, my... Friend killed him, but what was he? AK-74. Is it a 74? Yeah, it's a 74. <sighs> wow, that is... Um, I did not expect that. I did not expect that, but there we go. That's it. I'm dead. Um, I said this would be a... <laughs> that, well, I thought it was going to be a brief... Um, playthrough, didn't think it was going to be this brief, but, uh, yeah, there you go, that's Iron Man for you, um, that, I, I genuinely didn't expect that, I even loaded the better ammunition, like, I got one of them, I got hit, like, once, I think, by him or something, I was like, okay, uh, I'm on full health, I'll take one or two shots from the other guy, and then I'll be fine, but, now he just hit me with, like, six or seven, and, it. Um, I could have played that better, but honestly, I didn't. I didn't think there was a need to like hide all the way out somewhere or run. It, it is a. It is stupid terrain. Like, where am I supposed to hide? Like, like I hid there because that that's not cover. I mean, he could have shot me through the foliage. The AI doesn't see. Um, although the foliage doesn't affect the AI, so like, where do I hide? I have to go somewhere over there and then, and, you know, fight at a distance without a scope and stuff. It's, yeah, it's, okay, um, that's it then. That's, that's normally Iron Man mode. Uh, I do have more lives, um, I think I have, like, two or three left, uh, but I said I wasn't going to use them if I die in combat. So, you know, if you want me to continue... Write a comment down below and tell me, and I will. Um, but otherwise, I, I would call it here, or, uh, you know. Yeah. I don't know, I guess, I guess, I guess it's up to you. Do, you. do you think it's fair that I continue, or... Uh, or should I stop here? Tell me down in the comments below, and if, if you want me to continue, I'll, I'll do it. But uh, otherwise, this is it. Not unfortunate, I had a ton of money, too. I love how he's paying respects. Uh, I mean... Kind of. But, yeah, he's just sitting there with it. Like, on guard. Yeah, I'm going to in, in, um, interpret that as him paying respect. Okay. Thanks for watching, everyone. Um, 
I'll see you next time if you want me to continue, or uh, if not, I'll do I'll do something else. Have fun, take care, bye-bye.